So today I'll be showing you guys how to make a beanie design in Procreate. So the first thing you're going to do is go to your Safari, search a beanie mockup, go to images, and this is the beanie mockup that I chose, but you can choose any of the beanie mockups and I'll just save it. Now in Procreate, I'm just going to open up a square image with a white background and then I'm going to go to the actions button and add my beanie image. And for if you want like it to be multiple beanies, then you can copy that layer and put them on top of each other to make four, but it's only a tutorial, so I'll only do two designs. But again, if you wanted to do four, all you have to do is copy that layer. So I'm just placing it where I want it to go. Um, I was going to do four, but then I decided against it. So then you're going to see me try to move the beanies to the middle of the screen. And just to get it centered as best as I can. Now for the design, I'm going to open up Fonto and I'm going to use a transparent background and then I'm going to add the text and you can add any text, your logo, whatever. Um, you can also download fonts into Fonto. Um, and so I just downloaded my font in there, which the name should have popped up. When I was typing so if you want to see the exact name font name scroll back a little bit and I'm just adjusting it again just adjust the text how you want it I want the text to be closer together so I'm going to go to style and spacing and I'm going to make the text close together and I'm going to save it I'm going to keep it white you can change the color in Procreate, so you can make your white or black, whatever it is works best for you. Again, just adjusting the size, and then I'm going to save it as a PNG. Opening back up Procreate, you're going to go to the Actions button again, and this is where you're going to add your text photo. And before you do that, I forgot to change the color of the beanie. So in order to change the color of the beanie, in the right-hand corner where you see the color circle, you want to make sure that you pick the color that you want. If you go to Classic on the, the color button, you can type in the exact color number. Or you can do the color wheel and just find whatever color works best for you. Then before you transfer the color to the beanie, you want to make sure that you go to layers and beanie is selected. And then you're just going to drag the color over. And then it fills the beanie. Then go back to layers, click on the text, and then you want to click on this little arrow icon at the top left hand corner to adjust the text. I say use free form to start it out to like get the text in there. Then what I use is I'll go to warp.
now going to warp you then i click advanced mesh and that's just going to allow me to shape the text to the beanie and you're going to see me make it bigger and just drag and so you just drag and play with it i also have an alpha pencil so um that helps with like adjusting the font um if you do it with your hands it can be a little difficult but yeah, I'm just adjusting the text to fit the beanie. And yeah, you just literally keep playing around with that until you get it exactly how you want it to look. Now that I like my placement, I'm going to go and change the text color. Again, I'm going to go back to colors. Again, you can type the exact color number in, or you can just go to the wheel. I just decided to go to the wheel for this just because it's just I just wanted it to be quick. And then again, you just drag the drag the color onto the letters. And if you have to zoom in to get like any exclamation points or any small letters all you have to do is just zoom in and just drag the color to each letter Now going to my second design, I'm going to go back into Fonto again, change the text to what I wanted to say, and basically do everything all over again, um, adjust, the, adjust the text, spacing, any sizes, if you want it aligned, press center, and yeah, I'm just doing that again. This time I decided to change the, the color of the text to black just because I felt like black was easier to see on the colors that I had on the background because the white blended in. So again, opening back up, Procreate, and then insert the photo I just downloaded, use Freeform to adjust the text to fit inside the beanie. Now that the text can fit, I'm going to change the color. Again, just drag and drop the color. Drag and drop, drag and drop. Then... Now that the color is changed, you want to go to Warp and then Advanced Mesh. And then you're going to do just how you did the first one and adjust the text to the beanie size. Now that your design is done, I know some manufacturers are not just going to take the beanie mock-up. So what you need to do is to unshow layer the layer with the beanie. And that will just give you that will just let, let you have the design. And sometimes they'll need to change the color to black. So you just drag and drop and change the text color to black. And that will be all for this tutorial. If you want to see more, please.
please like, comment, subscribe. And yeah, that's it.